guys, I'm here in Arizona and I'm about to get ready for my show. So most of you have been asking me how to do my makeup for show. So I'm gonna show you guys step by step and uh, please pay attention to the products, okay? Foundation, it is in the color Honey Beige, okay? Honey Beige, just a little bit, not too much. And then just blend it. everywhere and then my concealer right on top of it get some under the eyes you guys know the routine make sure you get rid of the bags underneath the eyes the prairie loose foundation and then putting it underneath my eyes to bake my face there you go A quick dab. I'm going to use my eyebrow brush and draw my eyebrows real quick. Espresso and Broom by MAC mixed together. <laughs> Excess from the loose powder earlier over my eyebrows, so it make it even more softer, more blending. My Anastasia Tinted Brow in Chocolate, okay? And then just brush it over my hair. Make it look like I have some strands of eyebrows, so it's more blended, more natural all right then I'm gonna take my Stila I use this because it's really shiny and it's really pretty it's called the vintage black gold okay so it's by Stila and basically just use my hands to go at it just a little dab this is really like messy if you don't stay careful be careful with it so that and then just go straight onto your eyes lightly and then start blending upwards and whatnot. So I like to do that. It's like really shiny, so it gives me that stage glam. Same thing underneath the eyes. And you just keep going and blending. glittery looking thing it's called Cushy Life by MAC so just take some and then put it in the inner corners of your eyes it'll give you that fresh pixie look right in the corner it brings out the corners too and more focus to the eyes eyeliner by Shu Mora Next up is curling my lashes. Eyelashes. Get the eyelash glue and then 
prep it. I don't like to put the lashes on right away when I put the glue on. I want to wait until it dries a bit. So right now while I'm waiting for my lashes to kind of dry a little bit, I'm going to take my mascara by Shuomura and uh, do my under lashes. And then now I'm going to take my Shuomura eyeliner that I had earlier and then draw in the inner waterline. Then I'm going to take this tiny brush from MAC. I don't know the number because it, do it doesn't really say. It's kind of like faded out. So, tiny brush. Then take this from MAC called Guilty Association. And then just blend in the corners, these two together, so it looks like my eyes aren't as cheeky. Right there. Like that. Go. Corners and then also on the edge of the wings. Just keep blending. Round it off. Same thing on the other side. On the wings. Stick it on with this tweezer my fingers are stubby you can't really see so just kind of lay it on top and then adjust it on the ends All the whiteness that I have underneath here blend it up towards the eyes getting underneath wipe it off wipe it off next step is blush my makeup is everywhere so if I'm always looking down and trying to find it sorry try my best to be organized while I'm doing this and thinking about how much time I have left before I have to go out to show highlighting use the fingers this is what's up I did a YouTube YouTube tutorial on this earlier you guys could go back into my channel and check it out if you missed it it's highlighting and strobing you can see that there same thing over here let's get that cheek to pop you need that eyebrow to pop too. That eyebrow bone right above it. And then the lips. Keep it low. Becca highlighter. You can see that. Contour my my nose. I'm using this Burberry contouring color number two. Just slightly draw down the nose. foundation brush and start blending even more because it has the excess from the foundation and it'll blend even better. Next is the lipstick. This is a lip liner by Charlotte Tilbury in the color Pillow Top. So, line the lips, blend it in. For the inner, I'm gonna use Dose of Color Bear With Me. This 
is a matte lipstick because I think matte works better on me than gloss most of the time. So last step is the wig because now I have short hair and it's just too much work. So I'm gonna pop this wig on, call it a day. Okay, so this completes my look. I'm ready for show time. Um, thanks for getting ready with me. If you have any questions, please let me know. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Okay, all ready now. Just gotta tuck and lift things, to make sure things don't fall out. My final look from head to toe, got dressed. So if you guys are ever in the area that I'm going to be performing, please do come out. You can check out my tour dates. I'll be announcing it on Facebook. So please do come out if you guys are near me. Thanks for watching. Bye.